there's no scripture that ever condemned polygamy. Sure there is. And Deuteronomy 17:17, 17, 17, don't multiply wives. Okay. <laughs> okay, so I have a friend. Uh-huh. And he's um he was Christian, uh-huh. but now he's um kind of do- dive into Hebrew Israelite, yep. black Hebrews. Mm-hmm. Basically, it's like they live by the law of God, so on mm-hmm. and so forth, but also grapple to Jesus. So basically, the main issue is polygamy. So essentially, he's saying that the Old Testament allowed for polygamy, so having multiple wives, husbands having multiple wives, and that there's no scripture that ever condemned polygamy. Sure there is. And Deuteronomy 17:17. 17, 17. Don't multiply wives. Okay. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> and by the way, let me say one other thing about this, Rod. Not everything described in the Bible is prescribed in the Bible. Okay. And, and I think so many people, we think, oh, if it's written in the Bible, God must approve it. You know, uh, David's adultery is written in the Bible, but it's a description. It's not a prescription. Okay. There's a lot of descriptions. God, if, if you look at every time politi- polygamy was engaged in, from Genesis on, Everybody that did it, it resulted in disaster. Look at Solomon. So in, in that scripture where it says, because brought, I brought that up, where I said, said to the kings, it was for the kings, right? Do not take many wives. Do not so, multiply wives. Yeah. Okay, so what he takes that to mean is like, there has to be a certain amount. There has to be a certain, there has to be a bunch of them. Okay, time out. When he says that, it's not your job to refute what he says, it's his job to support what he says. What do you mean by that? And how'd you come to that conclusion? So you're saying that it means you can't have more than one wife. That's what that means. I'm good with it, but is that, okay. is that the, well, I'm good with it, but I just wanna, here's my, the question is this. I wanna have solid, cause I've debated him a bunch. Uh-huh. I wanna have solid All right. scriptural evidence, okay. you see what I mean, to, to give him the end it. There's a couple. <laughs> <laughs> Nail. All right. First of all, there's a, a buddy of mine by the name of Adam Coleman that does a lot of work on YouTube on the Hebrew Israelites. Check him out, Adam Coleman. Okay. And uh, also check out David Wood on YouTube, Acts 17. He does a lot with Muslims, but also Hebrew Israelites. And also Vocab Malone also deals with Hebrew Israelites. So they're more experts in that field than I am. So Adam Coleman, okay. David Wood, Vocab Malone. Okay, so check all that out. Now obviously, uh, God is for one man, one woman. Okay, that goes from Adam and Eve, it starts there. Didn't say Adam took several wives, he took Eve, okay? Just because it's described in the Bible doesn't mean it's prescribed. Just because it happened doesn't mean God approved. All right? Okay, thank you so much. Mm